Did you come here to train or chat? Let me know when you're ready to fight again, and I'll test you to see how you stack up against my records. Do you want to fight a big creature or a bunch of small ones? Don't worry. They make up for their size with numbers. Which creature would you like to fight against? If you change your mind, you know where to find me. Let me know when you're ready to fight again, and I'll test you to see how you stack up against my records. Do you want to fight a big creature or a bunch of small ones? Larger creatures can be quite challenging. Which one would you like to fight? Careful. A bog bite can be deadly. Good luck. Ready for some training? Well, you didn't set any records. Better look, Nick. Here are your results. See ya.
Remember me? So you... you killed her? I don't know what to feel. I've dreamt of this day ever since I was pulled from that stinking black raft. Since I watched them roll my mother in a shroud. And she was right. I don't feel better now that I've avenged their death. It just makes me miss her more. Thank you. Take this, it was mother's. I have my memories. Goodbye. There was a survivor on the ship, Bertrand Sesnick, a gnome. He says he knows a lot about alchemy. Be sure to welcome him to the keep. I'm ready to be sent out again any time. I've been searching the island for the last few days, and these are the shipwrecks I've found. Do you see one you'd like me to salvage? They sometimes send these ships out to establish new missions, so it's possible there's some building materials on board. I'll only be a day. Be wary. Exciting times, eh, my liege? I feel there's one more project in store for your keep. But I need to examine the old structures more closely, and I must meditate further on my dream. One bit of my vision tantalizes and confounds me. I saw a tower and a ship, but I don't understand how they're connected. I shall ruminate. Bye. Translation is ready for you. I don't think the author's advice is very good, but I guess anyone can write a book. Let me know when you have another one for me. I will need a day to translate this. Check back tomorrow. Take care.
Ugh. 
It's quite a beautiful day. Excellent. You've collected the essences. I'll need a day to restore the painting. I'm not done yet. Restoring such ancient paintings takes time. Take care. I could find a value on the wreck. I'm ready to go back out again whenever you like. These are the recent wrecks I've seen. If any of them seem worthwhile, let me know. I'm hoping this one has some blacksmithing supplies. I'll let you know what I find when I get back tomorrow. Be careful.
confess. My suggestion to steal the ship was made in jest. I never expected this. My own fate has always kept me trapped on Gallows End. I, I never dared to dream of escape. But you possess a quality, something I have never seen before. You did as you promised. Now I must do in kind. W what do you wish to know? You had asked me such a question, not but one day ago I would have said yes. Without a shadow of a doubt. But things have changed. Call it fate. Call it destiny. Call it the will of blasted Akara. An event is coming, and I wish to be a witness. I will stay. For now. He wanted to embrace death. He was ready. His peace was made. But Akara, in his incredible ignorance, saved Dead Kel from the Eternal Black. I don't know what the pirate wants, but I understand his rage. The Fallen One is not a surface dweller. He died once, and ever since he's preferred to stay beneath the ground. Akara Tor is his lair. Despite their history, Dead Kel and the Great Akara are still connected. Where you find one, you will find the other. Yes, which is rare on this island of scavengers and fanatics. I trust you, even though many years of hardship has taught me to do otherwise. I will confide in you, because despite my wish to leave this place, I have no desire to hurt the stranded souls that wish to stay. There is a spy in Cape Solace. One who is not as they appear. One who plans to disrupt the offering. If I could reveal their identity, I would. But my sight only tells me how the threads travel. Not where or to whom. Oh, this figure is powerful. Magical. It wields a strong grip over fate. Same as you. Use your gift. Open your eyes to the signs. If you are willing to see in a new way, you will find the one you are looking for. Akara. Our island god may be a devil and a manipulator, but he remains powerful. That is what this is all about. Dead Kel was formed by Akara's own. But the moment he was created, his true evil was apparent. The great Akara turned his back on Kel. Ever since then, the dreaded pirate has plotted to receive the blessing denied him, but without success. I know you will. I have not seen it in the cards, but. You are beginning to give me faith in the impossible. Go to the new scion, Alder's wife, Bridget, and protect her from this threat. Take these potions. They will help you track the spy. Be careful. Not everyone is dead, Kel. Not everyone can defeat death. The Requiem is ours. Now we must sail it to Cape Solace and give others the opportunity to join us! Hurry to Cape Solace!
marvellous. You stole the Requiem. What's the dreaded pirate to do now without his ship? Our passage from the island is secure. That is, if you're interested in leaving. And if you stay, I stay. Do not thank me. We stand together, you and I. We started this journey as companions, but the fires of adversity have made us something more. Friends. And I don't let my friends down. Well, not counting that time with Garant. He died. Now go. Find the turncoat. If Dead Cow means to disrupt the village's ceremony, he will do so soon. Good to see you. Here's all I could find of value on the wreck. I'm ready to go back out again whenever you like. There's a few wrecks off the coast. I could go investigate and bring back any loot if you'd like. Let me know if any of these are worth salvaging. If we're lucky, their treasure's still on board. Give me a day to find out. Be careful. How can I help you today? Greetings. You must be the master of the keep. Your scout, Zephwin, he found me on the coast. Hopefully I can be of some use here. I do offer training. We would sometimes make port there. It's a Varani trading town. We don't much care for outsiders there. To be honest with you, I was part of a pirate ship. We would steal cargo from other ships, and it was my job to hide it. You wouldn't believe the places you can fit goods into on a ship. We had just scored a huge load of cargo when we sprung a leak. I think we were weighted down too much. We had to abandon ship. We made it to this island, but my mates, they turned into those fair gorta. Fortunately, I got away before they could get me. We Varani like to sail, although not as much as the Deverga. The closest Varani city to here is Fort Olghorn. See you. Right. The painting was a sea cave. I took the liberty to hang it on the wall for you. Let me know when you want me to start on the next one. This next painting looks similar to this keep, but the land around it looks different. For this one, 
You'll need to kill some fair Gorda and Mergen. Bring the vials of paint back to me when they've changed color. Bye. Translation is ready for you. I don't think the author's advice is very good, but I guess anyone can write a book. Let me know when you have another one for me. This will give me something to do tonight. I should be finished translating it tomorrow. Take care. Greetings. Too late. We were all too late. The new Scion, Bridget, she's gone mad. I noticed that she'd been acting strangely, refusing food, talking to herself. Most Scions experience moments of opacity, but this was different. When I questioned her, she grew hostile. I've never seen anything like it. A new magic. Flashes of purple light. And then she was gone. Gone! You'll never find Bridget. Not unless you can see the invisible. I don't know. She has slipped free of this world. But I believe that we're all connected, hanging in the web of fate's grand design. There is an answer in the woven patterns. I just know it. Farewell.
cycle the fifth, a crack. I hear him, dear Meta. I hear him in every waking hour, a voice like the rumble of thunder, and one I shall never forget. I must confess, my expedition is over. Dead Kell and his hanged men have tracked me to this chamber. They call for blood. Apparently, they prize their preciously cultivated mystery. It is another weapon they can wield against the outside world. And what am I but light of truth? A bright spear with which to slay their darkness? But the voice, it reaches out to me. It promises to shelter me from the coming storm. He calls himself Akara, but I do not know what this means. What have I done by coming here? I only wish to learn the unknowable, discover the forgotten. But you warned me, and you were right, dear Ned. You were right. What do you seek, child? Bridget is gone. She resisted me at first, surrendered when she realized how painful I could be. Kel was correct. These villagers, so young, so foolish. And you, I see how you move through the world, how you tear through the threads of fate, where I only weave them. What are you? He said you'd find me in time, and here you are. It takes much to earn the gaze of dead Kel, child. You must truly be special. She stands before you. I am Bridget, and she is me. As far as hosts go, she has been adequate. But I only chose her because she is meant to be the Scion, and she is meant to possess the power. No, not yet, but it will end soon enough. Dead Kel will receive the blessing of Akara, even if it means that I must gain it first. No one shall stand in our way. Not man, not God. Farewell. <laughs> Ah! 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 Ah!
The offering is doomed. There is no scion to receive the blessing. Akara be praised. I didn't know. How could I? All Scions grow distant. They bear too much responsibility. They are only human. My poor Bridget. All she wanted was to serve Akara, and he allows this to happen. What is his protection worth if he can't stop one witch? Whatever shall we do now? The offering is upon us, but we have no one to offer. I don't know. I am shaken, as is my faith. We here on Gallows End are a fragile few. We have always survived by the grace of Akara. I weep for the loss of my wife, but I tremble for the loss of my god. Magic prevents dead Kel from entering this village and from taking part in the offering ceremony. He is broken and not worthy of Akara's blessing. The Whispering Witch would be his key to unlock the power he's always coveted. Possessing Bridget, she would take the role of Scion, and all of the power came with it. It was an insidious plot, but undeniably inspired. You! There are others who waited a lifetime for the opportunity, only to have another chosen. But you did have the vision to discover Dead Kel's plot, and the strength to defeat the Witch. Is there anyone more worthy of Akara's blessing? Yes, this is what must be done. Go to the ruins on the northern mountain and claim our people's birthright. There is no other way. The offering is held at the top of the northern mountain, in the ancient ruin called the Ring of the Watcher. I once knew Atari, but he was just a boy, and that was many years ago now. I wonder what ever became of him. You are the Scion now. My wife Bridget gave her life to stop Dead Kell's plot. It was a sacrifice to keep the rest of our village safe. That is how I will remember her. Strong. <laughs> 